Hi guys, so today I'm going to do a nail polish collection and I apologize for my hair. It is definitely just doing whatever it wants. So we're going to get started. I'm going to do it by brands. I'm going to do the random brands first that I have one of each and then go move on from there. So the first one I have is one that probably every little girl has in America and they're just this bonbon like purple this purple glitter polish which is super pretty um, for an overcoat um, so it's so pretty it's just in this little bottle um, but I've had it for a long time but it still works perfectly and I really like that one the next one is one that I got in a pedicure set a while ago and it's just the Miss Pedicure it's showing up a little more orange on camera than it actually is but um, like you can't just sell this one, it's not for individual sale. Um, so it came in this set and I like it, kind of. The next one is one I don't know the brand of, but I just wanted a black nail polish, just a black simple nail polish. And so I got this, it's the CQ Night. If you know the brand of it or like what this is, let me know in the comments below. Next one is a L'Oreal nail polish that was my mom's, the creamy white nail polish it's by l'oreal and it is called in the buff i don't know if you can read that in the buff the last single one that i have is a nicole by opi it is in the color you're an angel and it's just this really pretty peachy pink shimmery color i loved this for um, spring and summer. I got it last summer so I didn't get to really wear it in the spring but I'm so excited to wear this in the spring. Essie and this is the turquoise and it's just this really really pretty um, bluish green color. I just think this is so 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 pretty. The first one that we're going to do is Love My Nails. Um, this brand used to be my favorite. I can't find it anymore so if you know where to get them let me know. This is the only one that I don't have the color for because it was on top. I don't know if you can see that. Um, and then the sticker came off. But it's just this really pretty um, blue color. Um, I really like it. And it's... It looks like your nails are wet. It even says on the bottle for that deep wet look. And it's so pretty, this color. I love it. The next one is this beautiful peach color with brown undertones and it is in Plus Mauve if you can read that it's just the perfect color for spring the next one is in Tropical Fruit this one used to be my favorite um, just because it was just a pop of color and it's just this beautiful pink um, color and it's actually showing up a little more red on the camera Let's see if you can see it like back here it's more of a, like a dark bright pink um, a dark hot pink I'd say but it's just such a pretty color and um, there's not very much left in it I don't know if you can really tell um, but it's definitely like at least down to here so I really need to find a color like this because I really like this color or find this brand the next one is a red color also by love my nails and this is Manhattan red this one has more pink to it. Um, it's showing up a lot. It's showing up really red on camera. It's really not that red when you put it on your nails. It's more of a pinkish red tone. So if you do wear something red, it kind of tends to look a little funny um, depending on the shade. But it really isn't the best red color. The next one is a chrome. Love my nails. So it's just this gorgeous green color. Um... And I've used about to here. You can see the line right there. And it is in the color Envy. Again, just this beautiful green um, color. This is was my first green nail polish. I so those are all my Love My Nails products. The next products will do Wet n Wild. So the first one is this blue bluish black color, which I got for my internship. I think I got all of these on the same day, to be honest with you. Um... It was last summer and I just, this last summer I really got into makeup and nail polish for some 
weird reason. I've never been um, into that kind of stuff at all. Um, but I recently, this last summer, got really into it. And I think I had a lot to do with my internship. Just wanted to look good and more professional. But still, like, I don't know. Anyways. So I got this color, which was a really... Um, I really like this color because it looks, um, from far away it looks black and then you get closer and it has these like blue tones to it. It is in the color Blue Moon. Um, but it's just, I love this color. The next one I got, which is kind of similar to that one, um, is this, the same type of thing but in purple, which it's showing up a little more blue than it actually is. This is in the color Eggplant, Eggplant Frost. And it's just the same type of thing. It looks black from far away. And then it has these like navy and purple um, coloring to it. And it's so pretty. Um, I use probably this the most of all of them. But I really like this. The next three are summer shades. The first one is a color called French White. Let's see if you can read that. It's right here. And it's just a white nail polish. Um, I did not have one. Um, this is still the only one I have. Um, I don't wear white a lot because I can only wear, that's why this is my summer shade because if I wear white any other time it's going to make me look more pale. Um, but if I wear it in the summer when I get tan it looks fantastic and it makes me look so much more tan than I am. Um, the next one is this really light pink color in Tickled Pink. Everyone likes that name. And it's just this really, this really light baby pink color. This color is one of my favorites. It's a orange, it looks more orange on the camera, but it's more like an orange pink coral color. Let's see if you can see it better if I put it, like, I don't know. I think it's too bright. Like, you can kind of see it's more corally, like, has pink tones in it. And it's so pretty. It's the color Blazed. We're now going to move on to the Avon, and I actually have four Avon. first one is the Avon Speed Dry, and I think I've shown this in a video before. Um, it is the Fusion, and it's just this really pretty pink um, shimmery color. I just like this color for all year round, and it's not too pink, so you can get away with wearing red with it um, if you don't have time to do your nails, which I don't always have time, so I like picking more neutral colors that um, most of my clothes go with or I can find an outfit that easily goes with it. This next is a very matte color and I don't know if it has a color. It's mint and it's just this green, light green color. Again, perfect for spring and summer. It's just a very matte finish. It's not shimmery. It's not glossy. It is what it is. Like It looks like your nail is green. Um, this one and the next one I'm going to show you both are like that. The next one is the same type of deal. It has no shimmer, um, no sparkle, no nothing. Um, it's just matte, your color. That's what it is. This one looks really cool because it doesn't look like the color of your nails. Like it looks, um, it comes off a lot brighter than that. And it's a really cool um, thing. If I paint my nails, probably... I probably paint my nails one of these two colors in the spring, during the springtime. And if I paint them, I will definitely show you what I mean when I talk up, when I tell you that. Um, but yeah, the last nail polish is an Avon nail polish. It's this bright, bright, orangish, reddish, pink color. Um, again, they're showing up so much brighter on camera because um, this is more like what it is. Um, my boyfriend's mom actually got it for me. So that's exciting. And it is also an Avon Speed Dry. This is probably their new bottle. And this is in the Mambo Melon. So, um, my grandma used to work for Avon. That's where I got the other three um, for either birthday or Christmas gifts. And then I got this one the last year from my boyfriend's mom. And the first one we'll do is the Sally Hansen. And we'll start with the hardest nails. This first one is this Aqua Blue. It's so, so pretty. Um, everyone always tells me it matches my eyes. You think it matches my eyes? I think it kind of does. But um, it is called the Marine Scene. And as you can see, it's just a beautiful, beautiful ocean blue. Um, 
doesn't have as much green as I would think, but it's such a bright, pretty blue. The next one is Peach Daiquiri. Daiquiri. It's also by Sally Hansen Hard as Nails, and as you can see, I've used that much of it. And it's just this really pretty peach um, color. Again, it's showing up a little more orange on camera, but it's just a light um, peach color. This is another one I don't have the name for, but it's this really pretty Sally Hansen Advanced Hard as Nails color. And it has um, like pink and purple and then like brown undertones. It's so, so pretty and I really like this a lot. The Sally Hansen Crackle and this is just in no blast, it's just the white one. Um, I'm not a super huge fan of Crackle, but I thought I'd give it a try and it's all right. The next one is Boca Mocha. It's light brown color with some red in it, which you can, it's really picking up the red in the camera. So this is really pretty. Next one is Grass Slipper. And my boyfriend picked this color out. He likes bright colors. And I really like this color a lot. The next one is the one I actually have on my nails right now. And it is called Guilty Pleasure. And it's just this beautiful chrome um, gold color. And I'm not normally a fan of gold, so I decided to try it. I'm not a huge fan of gold. And so this is a gold, but it has like brown in it. So I really like that. Um, and so I really wanted to try this color out and just see how I liked it. Um, cause it was kind of one of those colors that's definitely out of my comfort zone cause nothing really matches it. I feel like. But the last company is Zoya, and I've talked about this company quite a bit. I did do a Zoya haul, I believe, which I can link down below quite a while ago. Um, I'm not sure if I did. If I didn't, I'll probably cut this out. But I've gotten two in my birch box, which I really like. I really like this company. Um, and I have like their book that has all their nail polishes, and I really want to order again from them. The first one I ever got was in Jewels. And again, this one, um, at first I thought this one and the gold one was similar, but this one definitely has, as you can tell, a lot more silver in it. And it has hints of green in it, because um, I actually got it last April in my birch box, and it was like the go green month, partly because of the, just the way Zoya is, and then partially because in some lights it has green, and as you can tell, like, it does have some gold shimmer and some silver shimmer in it. It's just the coolest color ever, and I love it. Izzy is the next one I got. I got this one this December, and um, this one, I really like the color. It's more of a summer color for me. Um, I don't wear this color a lot in the winter, so it's definitely more of a summer color, um, but I really still like it, and I like the shimmery effect it has, and some of so the first time I got it, I didn't have as much nail polish as I had now, and I was really wanting to get some more. So I went a little crazy and bought six. And breezy. And again, it's just this really bright blue color. It's a lot more muted than this color. Um, it's just uh, has more, has darker undertones to it. So it's just a wonderful in-between color, and it kind of reminds me of like jeans. The next one is a purple one, and I'm not gonna lie, I got this because of the name. Um, my one of my best friends, name is Caitlin, and this is how she spells it, and it made me super excited. I uh, I had to get it. My name's not on there, of course, but whatever. But I do like this color a lot, um, and it's this purple again with the darker undertones to it. Um, so it's really pretty. It has like grayish to it until you get to, it looks kind of gray until you get to this color, which is true gray, which is Dove, which I really like this color. Really like it. Um, the next one is kind of like, um, I had, I just recently got this and I got these last April, but these look very similar. This one is definitely more red. Um, this is the Izzy one I showed you before and this is the Rouge. As you can tell, the Izzy is a lot more red and has some shimmer to it. This one's a lot more just like matte and just brighter pink, but um, really like these as well. The next one is Marley, which remind me of Marley and Me, the dog movie, um, sad movie. 
this light lilac purple, which I think would be perfect for spring. Next one is Dovey, which looks nothing like Dove. It is a um, kind of peachy color, which this color looks a lot like my nails, just improved. The last nail polish, guys. It's the last one. Okay, so this is not a super bright green, but it's not like a dull green. It's kind of like that blue um, color. But it's just this really pretty green. It is called Gemma. So, yeah. I don't have a nail polish I don't like the color of. Um, I have some complaints for some. Um, but for the most part, I really like the color. It's just the clothing that goes with it is sometimes really difficult. Um, because I have to match and I don't have time to redo my nails every day. Um, so normally it's like once a week maybe or when it really starts chipping. That wraps it up. I can't put anything on the wall so it's kind of hard um, to get a nail rack. Um, I might make one. I'm not sure yet. Um, cause I'm not sure what's going to happen next semester. If I'm going to stay in this place or if I'm going to move to a bigger apartment, we'll find out. Um, I just keep it in this plastic container. It's really nice cause you can look down on it and you can see all the colors. Um, and then you can kind of look around and it has the colors in there as well. So that is that. I'm sorry that's so long. I apologize, but, um, that's my nail polish collection, and I will talk to you guys later. If you have any comments or questions, leave them below, and I will talk to you later. Bye!